Well, the troubleshooters looks into yet another dispute with a home contractor. Action 10's Andy Lascano is here to show us what this problem is all about, Andy. All right, guys, stop me if you've heard this one before. A couple calling the troubleshooters for help with a contractor. The contractor supposedly has not finished the job. The couple says they've already paid him approximately $7,000 to do. He was going to build an addition room, add it to the bedroom back here, okay. and uh, also extend the, ki the kitchen over here. Mary Don Hill says she was really looking forward to this work getting done at her house on Hayward. Right before Hurricane Harvey hit, she and her husband hired Jake Cavazos of JT Construction to do it. Total cost for the entire job, $10,600. She claims this is Cavazos in the pictures you'll see in our story. Why did you choose him? Well, he was coming to our church okay. and he was buying candles, so, you know, I... She trusted him, paid him $1,400 to start the job, then just weeks later, she says he asked for more, a lot more. $5,600 more. I said, oh, I was like kind of hesitating, but I wanted my addition to get done. Hmm. So I said, well, I gave him the benefit of the doubt. If you're adding it up, Rangel had already paid Jake Cavasso $7,000 at this point. $7,000. For this? Yeah, yes. For this? Rangel claims Cavasso told her the oak tree in the backyard had to be removed for the job to get done. It was. All this material is just sitting in her garage. And that's pretty much it as far as work getting done for $7,000. So now what? Rangel says she and her husband gave Cavazos chances, but he never did anything. They also claim they had an attorney send Cavazos this demand letter, which reads in part, quote, all that Rangel's have to show for their payment of money is the hole where the oak tree had once been in their backyard. So they filed a civil suit against Cavazos. However, the notice was returned to them. The troubleshooters went to the address that Angels have for Cavazos. No one answered the door. Cavazos by phone this afternoon. He told us he never intended for this matter to get to this point, but he says some things happened with the Angels that he didn't like. But he does plan to meet with them to get this resolved. They can allow him to finish the job, or he can give them a mutually agreed upon refund. Let's see what happens next. As always, whenever you need our help, just give us a call, 885-0100.